Hi, we would like to share with you five moments of hand hygiene. So why do hand hygiene? This is to prevent transfer of bacteria, to remove visible soiling from hands. So to prevent acquiring infection, we just need to follow some simple steps. Here's how. Listen carefully. First, wet hands and apply enough soap. Rub hands palm to palm, then right palm over left torso with interfaced finger and vice versa. Then palm to palm, finger to finger, interface. Back of finger to opposing palms with finger interlocked. Then rational rubbing of left thumb, clasp in right palm and vice versa. Rational rubbing backwards and forwards with clasped finger or right hand in left palm and vice versa. Then, rinse hands with water. Dry thoroughly with a single-use towel. Now, you're ready for your first work. So, when do we do this? Come on, let me show you. This is done before touching the patient. Why? Well, this, we make sure that we do not transfer anything to our patient. By this way, they will stay protected from our environment. Then, we do this also after touching the patient. By this, we protect ourselves and our colleagues and the other patients or clientele. For extra safety or protection, it is better to wear PPE or personal protective equipment especially for contact precaution patient and make sure to do the proper donning so we do hand rub or hand washing after body fluid exposure risk this is to protect yourself and the healthcare environment from harmful patient germs We also do this before aseptic or clean procedures. Before insertion of cannula, before taking or extracting blood, before entering the patient and doing x-ray. Last, we do this after touching patient's surroundings. This is to protect yourself and the healthcare environment from harmful patient's germs. Keep protected everyone!